Hey guys, what's up? I Sec the Tron here from One Hype Gazette here with the next video, and this is another round of live action uh, covering a war in Immoral Thieves. I was actually planning on rec uh, recording in Genesis, but uh, the war is a pretty bad matchup with a clan that's not uh, doesn't have very good bases and a pretty big mismatch as well. So uh, luckily, my second account, which is mainly in here for CWL clan war coverage, uh, will be able to get some live action from the Immoral Thieves war. Uh, should be uh, uh, some good attacks. There's some good bases. The other clan looks pretty solid. So that's a plus, and uh, we should get to that in just a moment. Real quick, though, first I want to say that I um, might not have a few videos over the next few days, possibly one on like Friday or something, but uh, with the holiday, I'm going out of town. I'm not going to be able to record, so uh, just be aware of that if you don't see as many videos. But I should be back on Sunday and have an upload then covering uh, some of the CWL action that will happen this weekend, which should be interesting. I look forward to seeing that and covering it when I get back. So that being said, let's uh, hop into the war and uh, see if we can catch some live attacks. So we are a little bit late to the party, it looks like, on this one. Uh, just hopped in here. I think it's... <clears throat> yeah, this is going to be an air attack. Uh, looks like he's sending in some Lava Hounds, Balloons, has some Hastes. I'm not exactly sure. The he Both his heroes have been expended, so I guess... I don't, I don't know what he took out with the heroes. It looks like not much, because the Queen is still up. I don't know about the CC troops. I assume those are dead. Uh, the Balloons are making their way through, but it doesn't look like there's going to be enough to get past... Um, that last layer of the base with the Teslas and everything. You know, I think, you know, based on looking at the top there with the heroes, um, his own heroes kind of sitting dead up there, I think what happened is what his, he sent his heroes in uh, to get the CC troops, the Queen, and all those Teslas popped up, killed his heroes before they could do anything, and because of that, it looks like uh, the balloons aren't going to get the job done because the Queen is still up along with all those defenses. So a nice try to this is Killer Knot. We'll take a look at the uh, beginning of the attack just to confirm what I think happened. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure he used his heroes at the beginning and tried like to uh, to get the CC troops and the queen, but just too much uh, for the heroes, especially with the Teslas there. So nice try. Um, looks like things are going to peter out. That Lava Hound finally pops and the balloons will go down shortly, and that'll just about be it. All right, uh, we'll go back here. Um, looks like we have a defense going on. Not going to show that, obviously, but uh, yeah, he'll just let his lava pups, I guess, run around, do a few things. Uh, we'll go ahead and give him a nice try, and uh, yeah, I mean, it was a good plan. Just the Teslas definitely complicated it. Had the Teslas not been there, you know, who knows how it would have gone. Still would have been probably tight because the queen is relatively deep inside the base there. Um, with the king, with the king protecting her. But yeah, we'll go back in and uh, just taking a look at it. Uh, He's going to let the pups run, so we'll have to wait another 20 seconds or so to uh, to see the beginning of the attack so it shows up in the log. Um, looks like some people are on to my presence, but uh, I doubt they know I'm recording at this point. Or maybe they do. Uh, but anyway, nice try to kill or not. We'll go ahead and back out right now because it looks like, yeah, that Tesla's going to get all those uh, little pups and stuff. Uh, okay, one more attack, actually. Okay, nice. We got another attack going on. Uh, this is Tannic. And we are, once again, a little bit late to the party, but uh, not as late as the last one. We're able to see him put his king, his queen down. Another air attack and another um, just very small kill squad push. I think he probably knows what's in the CC. Maybe he already lured the CC, I'm not sure. Uh, but basically dropped down his king to kind of tank for those wizard towers, I guess. And get some trash, the queen to take out the defensive queen. So really just two heroes and can invest all his other troops in the air attack, um, as, as well as all his spells, really. So a lot a lot going uh, in the air on this one. And I think he has five Lava Hounds, so just making sure he has plenty of tanking. Uh, Balloon's making their way through, has a heal for them, uh, which he does drop right there. There's a Tesla farm. Not sure if this is a cleanup, uh, once again. So, uh, I mean, hard to tell. I, I missed how many stars were on the base when I went in. So you can probably tell if you go back and look at that, but... Um, the balloons are kind of clumped up here in that lava hound. That last one he sent in probably wasn't the best timing because it, it got destroyed before the balloons were even close to the air defenses. And now that they are in range, there's nothing to tank for them. The haste will get that air defense probably, but that's about it. Another uh, no-go right here. So nice try once again. <clears throat> Sorry, a little bit sick actually. Uh, this is Tannic, and uh, yeah, I'm not going to get the job done. Um... Pups will once again uh, make their way around, 
taking out a few more buildings. We'll go ahead and back out and uh, yeah, give them a, a nice try. Actually, I think I'm going to try to do one of those uh, recording things. I put like an eye between the bushes. Um, I did that in Genesis, so maybe they, they can take the hint and see if uh, see if they understand that I'm recording. If I can find with that, yeah, I don't know. I'll do it later. I, I don't want to have to try to find all the emojis I use. Kind of a waste of time for a video. But anyway, uh, let's go back and take a look at the uh, initial replay uh, on the base where the Tesla's popped up. Is that one not it? Um, did that other one, like, log yet? I, this is the... This is the one we just watched, I think. Yeah, okay. Maybe that first one was it. Sorry, I'm getting confusing myself now. I know, okay, this is the base, yeah. This, yeah, this is the base. Uh, drops down a giant, and then the king and the queen. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Not Don't have to watch much or for very long. Uh, basically, the Teslas popped. I don't think even if the Teslas weren't there, it would have been very difficult to get the queen and the CC troops, which I assume he was going for. But anyway, I uh, hope you guys like those first two attacks. I'll hang out and see if we can get some more for you guys. Probably some more Town Hall 9s at this point. Okay, another one. Hopefully, I'm not too late. Uh, this is Ragnar, and uh, another air attack. Is this that base that um, we just saw, or is it a little bit different? I can't even, it looks familiar, I don't actually, I don't even know. Um, but anyway, it looks like it's going to be another air attack, like I said. Uh, this is one of those air attacks, remember the attack meta video, we talked about this already, where there's three golems, and it's a very deep push into the base. Actually, typically we only see two golems, but three golems, huge investment. Hopefully the king doesn't get too far out in front because he's going to be important in taking out the queen. But it looks like he's already being targeted. Uh, the queen did hop the wall, fortunately, so it should be a pretty easy queen kill. Pops the king's ability, has the rage for the bowlers, the queen. Uh, the golems are moving through. Should get, I mean, access to all four of these air defenses, really. He does have one lava hound if he needs it. Uh, it looks like things will get delayed because the queen is on the sea. You see Lava Hound, so that it, it'll explode right there. Uh, the pups are going to kind of distract things for a moment. Uh, but the troops still moving forward. Looks like he might have a shot at that fourth air defense if the queen, uh, yeah, right there she steps up for it. So it has really one Lava Hound he might not even need, plus 12 balloons. Uh, I talked about this before, but that's, this is one of the types of air attacks. In addition to some of the earlier ones, which is mainly air, this one can work well too, where you bring... Um, you bring multiple uh, golems, uh, as, as many as three, like in this attack, you bring bowlers. Typically works better for the 30-30 heroes, or at least high-level heroes like Ragnar has, uh, as you saw in this attack, but can work for mid-level heroes as well. And uh, pops the queen's ability. This one looks like it should be over. Uh, pretty much no air targeting stuff left up besides that one wizard tower. The queen may go down, but... Um, yeah, it looks like the queen will probably go down, but the balloons should be enough for cleanup. There is one wizard. Things are kind of spread out, though, and I don't think he has any lava pups. Oh, right there. Um, l lucky him, the uh, lava hound took like three seeking air mines all at once. Uh, so it has those pups. The queen's still up, I think, unless she hits any bombs or anything. She'll help. So that's, a, that's a huge help having the queen up as well. Um, looks like this one should be a pretty easy three star then. Uh, Builder's Hut in the corner is the only issue, but the pups are going to make their way down and uh, the wizards closing in on the left, the queen, the balloons on the right. Um, should have this one, might be a little bit close as I speak here, but uh, no, this is going to be a three star. Nice attack to Ragnar. Um, don't want to back out quite yet, but I um, 95% sure this is a 3 star. Everything else is taken care of. Just has to get these last two buildings and that will do it. Awesome attack. Um, like I said guys, good use of that uh, of that other type of air attack that does a big kill squad. Um, all of those air defenses were pretty central which allowed him to go in there and take pretty much yeah all four of them out and uh, not really even need that Lava Hound but it did tank for the Tesla farm which was something that was beneficial. So uh, anyway, I'll hang out and see if I can get one or two more attacks. Okay, looks like uh, another attack. This might be our last one as I have to kind of wrap it up here. But luckily for us, we have a Town Hall 10 versus Town Hall 11 attempt. I was thinking it might be all Town Hall 9 attacks tonight because uh, I'm only recording for the first kind of few hours of war. But actually, um, which is probably the case with a lot of clans, definitely in Genesis, uh, there's, there's attacks early on 
to two star these town hall 11s because it needs to be done uh, the town hall nines can't do it even if there's attacks left over from from them the town hall 11s typically not worth it so the town hall 10s get going pretty early usually in the war as far as trying to get these 11s two starred and this one is a bowler attack so i think i kind of gave this an honorable mention in the attack meta not used that much we see valks and dragons probably more but um, I think it can work. It looks like things are going pretty well. Has the funnel created nicely, which is good. The two jumps letting things all the way in. The eagle is lighting up, and those infernos should engage pretty soon. But the king is in the middle. I'm not sure what else is as well. Um, he can kind of do some... So he can do something. I'm not sure if he can take out it all by himself. Pops the queen's ability. I just don't think there's enough in by the town hall. Unless the queen's on it, she actually gets the town hall. It's down a percentage, which I think he has with those four baby dragons and the rage left over. Unless he doesn't hit too many seeking air mines right there, he hits one. So this one might be a little bit closer than we thought. That other dragon is being very heavily uh, targeted. He has one more remaining. Goes ahead and drops that rage now, which is probably a good decision. Maybe get that cannon. Yeah, I think it'll get the cannon. Uh, yeah, cannon goes down 48%. If he hits the seeking air mine, that would be unfortunate. He has to be careful. He doesn't want to drop it in a place where there probably is a seeking air mine. Probably a good spot right there. The corner was probably a, a place for a seeking air mine, so it's good he avoided that. This is going to be close here. Gets the 50% awesome attack. Uh, really came down to it, especially on the town hall dive. Had the queen not locked on, that would not have been a two-star. And uh, came down to every building, 50% uh, two-star. And one more, actually, I guess we're getting a bonus attack. Uh, just went underway. This one, surprisingly, looks like to be an HGHB attack. Don't see these very often. I think I kind of mentioned they were going out of style in the attack meta video. But um, here it is, and it looks like it's a pretty good opener thus far. Uh, it has the troops moving forward, the healers on the giants, uh, poison for the CC troops as they come over. They are targeting the queen and the healers, unfortunately. The angle just didn't work out that well. But Pops the queen's ability, she can get through them pretty quickly. And luckily, besides the queen, they didn't attack many other troops. So has everything moving forward. Those giants are in huge numbers under those rages, uh, going, through the, through the, going through those walls almost in instantaneously and uh, has 12 hogs left to deploy with uh, two heals. That's the power of the strategy when you do it right is kind of everything moves through then you realize, wait, I still have 12 hogs left as well as two heal spells. Um, sometimes you have a huge leg up on the base. Uh, but that being said, there is a, a Tesla farm at the bottom here. Seems like people never attack from the side of the Tesla farm. I guess besides the attack earlier uh, today that had the... Uh, the attack where the heroes died to the Tesla farm at the beginning. But it seems like it's always left up for hogs, which is never a good thing. But I think he should still have the power. He's being nice and patient on these hogs. Uh, wants to get value for the giants. And regardless of the hogs, I don't think he needs them. The heroes alone um, are going to be able to fight through uh, pretty far, being both at full health and both level 30-30. Has that last heal to give those hogs a boost, as well as the giants. And then he should come in with those five hogs. Probably not right now. That's a, that's a good decision. Uh, wait for something to start tanking. Wait for the giants to get through or wait for the king to come over, and uh, doesn't even need these hogs, to be honest. Yeah, he's going to go through this base pretty easily. Um, five hogs left over. Start sprinkling them in, which is a good idea, but yeah, this one is over. Unless there's anything in the corner that's going to be an issue, but no, uh, up to 91%. Only needs another 20 seconds or so to take out the rest of the space. Not even, actually. So awesome attack to this is Rambus. Getting the uh, three-star and uh, doing a strategy that people haven't been using really at all lately. This is the first time I've seen it in a while, but I think it can work. And maybe just being in Genesis, the attacks are a little bit different. Um, and that's just kind of how it works out. So hope you guys like this video. I hope you enjoy the Thanksgiving break. And uh, might not have another video for a few days, but I'll get back to it soon. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Sack the Tron out.